What's up, bro? Extend your arms out. Click the right stick to calibrate. Right stick to rotate. Use the right stick to rotate to the right. Use right stick to rotate to the right twice.
trying to walk like a human. <laughs> I'm trying to walk like a human in VR. I'm moving my legs so I can get at least the natural flow. Yo, this would be so fucking cool, IRL, man. Nature augurs the void, and so you've been brought into existence. What purpose breath life into you has yet to be revealed. But the shimmering road you have walked has always led to other, to their destiny. It is only the beginning of your journey. Now oh, this is so dope, man. So graphically beautiful! It would have been beautiful normally! The Sea of Serpents.
expect me to be impressed? Why, well, I could have slain the beast with one hand tied behind my back. I do not run from danger. Cowards go straight to hell. Not I. For the bowl, there is nothing to lose. All to gain. Go near. Get behind me. My destiny is in my hands. If I'm afraid of you, eh? He went down with his ship like a fool. <laughs> Excellent. Come, find me in Asgard. Just as cold turns water into ice, the actions of individuals can crystallize their virtues, can be made solid by God's ragging. Ragnvold's actions led to the destruction of his fleet and proved him to be a fool, which was transmuted into fool stone. Is this Mides? Hi, Mides. I didn't know I was in this game. You are in this game, Mides. You are in this game. Were you the guy on the ship, Mides? You were the guy on the ship. How's it going, bro? How is your morning? Your morning goo. I'm just gonna play this for a little bit and then bounce. You know what I'm saying? This is so cool. This is so cool. I said Blade and Sorcery was probably the coolest VR game I had. And then, I mean, every VR game I have is pretty cool. In its own way. This is like legit, legitimately dope. It's like legitimately cool as fuck. Azure's Azure's Hall. Like look how freaking look at my shadow. Like look at that. Literally I'm a god. Literally. You were the you were the ship dude? Hell yeah. I mean I mean you kinda died and you got your whole fleet killed, but you know, how are you how are you supposed to handle the Kraken by yourself? That's what I came. You were like, I could have done a better job myself. I don't have to walk like this, but I think it's awkward if I just have my hands to my side. No one walks like this, like ever. You at least sway your arms to some degree. It's a bird. So I want to make it somewhat real. It'd be interesting if life worked like this. Yeah, you guys killed. So I could win. Thank you, Midas. You're always thinking of others. I see boobies! Where everybody knows your name. Meet six patrons. Hold to open up the main menu. So we have exit, settings, world map, quest book, inventory, recipes, and tutorials. Check this out. Everybody knows your name. You have found Aegir's Hall, uh, a mead hall run by the sea giant, Aegir. It is a place that gods and goddesses frequent to catch up on gossip to argue and to enjoy a tank tankard of Aegir's famed ale. Explore this tap and familiarize yourself with some of its regulars. Cool. 
All right, what we got over here? Is this Loki? Hey. What are you doing? Just letting you car shit? Can I actually drink? Whoops. I can actually eat, though. breaks even though I set it down. Meet the traveling man, the low keys. Yeah, bongo. Bongo, 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 bongo. Bongo, 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 What we got? Who's this over here? Here you guys. What's up? What's up? What's up, lovely lady? You guys drinking some ale? Can I have some? What's up, guy? How y'all doing? What's up? That guy's over there. Oh, what's up? That guy's over there. Fucking slump, boy. That boy's over there slump. I come back when you've got some coins. Alright, I'll come back when I got some coins. You got a monkey. Can I bet the monkey? What's up, guy? Oh, oh, hey, did you hear about the mighty sea monster? Let me guess, it was a this thing. What do you want? I'm busy. It's the blacksmith. stairs like that instead of doing it normally for those people that get motion sick. What's up, Loki? What you got, son? Agir! Ale for me and my friend. Come and drink. To victory! To victory! Ah, uh, little god, you have gained glory. You're a Kraken Slayer. <laughs> and you have earned my favor. With my guidance, you will wield great power and learn to be a true god. I, the great, the powerful Loki, will be teacher. And you 
my honored pupil. In return, I require the hero stone you acquired from the Kraken. It is but a small payment for my infinite wisdom. Come now, hand it over. Well, I have something for you, too. Take it. What is this? With that rune, a whole world of possibilities awaits. Now. There is a shield maiden. Her mouth spits flame like a dragon, and she seeks to burn another of Asgard. Go! Find her, and help her fulfill her destiny. It infinitely goes. All right, one more. All right. Woo! This is cooler than the whole world. This is cooler than the whole world right now. Whoa. This map is huge, bro. This will be the last thing we do. And then we're gonna end thy stream. But this is dope. This is like the coolest thing in the world. Oh, we're over here. When confused, the target is temporarily disorientated and switches allegiance. Allies turn against each other. And the instigator comes out on top. It's literally the coolest thing in the world, man. I like it. And it's a story game, so it's not like I'm just mindlessly killing stuff. Although I would love to mindlessly kill stuff. Fought a whole ass Kraken. I wonder what god I'll become in the end. Like, God of what? God of what? There are so many omnipotent beings throughout history and religion and tradition and whatever. So many.
not dead yet. Is that a fucking shark, bro? Drown me. Burn me. No matter what you do, Tyr, I will hunt you down. <sighs> Gods and goddesses of Asgard, help me avenge my brother! And there she is, the Spitfire Shield Maiden. No time to lend a helping hand, hmm? Now, you have the power to possess this mortal. Reach out! What is this? This energy! What is this feeling? Have the gods answered my call? I knew you showed potential. Now, mortals need sustenance to survive or recuperate from injury. Look around for nourishment. Maybe I need to eat. The wreck has weakened me. Yum, yum, yum. What the fuck? Get out of here, bird. I need to eat. So weak. What more do I need to eat? Good. Feeling better? You don't look like a lifeless drug any longer. Come over here. I have something for you. Over where? What the fuck? That's brutal, man. I have created this pouch for you. It can store countless items along your travels. Take it. Items you find can be stored in the pouch on your hip. Have a look around. Put three items. Excellent. You should hold on to that one. That looks interesting. I should probably show you how to return to your godly form. This is a god altar. The gateway between your godly form and that of a mortal. To activate it, you will need a god rune. Retrieve the god rune from your pouch. Go ahead, grab the god rune. Set the rune in its place on the god altar. Perfect. Return to your godly form. A power is flowing in and out of me. <laughs> Move around! What do you see? From here, you have a larger view of their world. In this form, you can move and manipulate objects like toys. You can open pathways and change the course of a hero's destiny. It's like the coolest thing in the world, bro. You have a natural affinity with the beast. Could you be the god of animals? Now, I grant you the power to transform that shark to do your bidding. I am sworn to protect. Good, my pupil. With my guidance, other beasts will be at your beck and call. Set it on the ground and return to the shield maiden. Your powers are developing rapidly. With the god altar active, you can switch at will between the girl and your godly form. Agir's bastard son. What is this monster? 
It is not attacking me. Yes. I see an ally summoned by the gods to aid me. Huh? My blades are at your command. Nice. Followers will obey your every command. They have unique talents that can be called upon. See what the shark makes of this tasty corpse. Pointed that cage to activate the shark's ability. This disgusting beast has cleared a path. It's time to move forward and continue with the Shield Maiden's pursuit of revenge. We will need to provide her with weapons and equipment. Let's search the tombs. <clears throat> we should have a look at these tombs. Come up. Go there. It's the coolest thing in the world! I'm like so immersed right now, man! Dragar! You dare defile my kin's tomb? You will find no treasure here! Only your end. It seems this tomb is still occupied. Be cautious. You don't have a weapon yet, so you'll have to command your follower to fight for you. A truly deadly beast in my control. My enemies will break with fear. I think that's enough of my guidance for now. It's time for you to use your own ingenuity. Continue searching the tomb for a weapon. Yeah. Would you like? I don't know what that is, but I guess I'll keep it. Hi. The stench of rot and disease. It must be years since anyone has set foot in here. The Draugar are drawn to the treasure. Maybe I can find a weapon hidden deep below. Yes, yes, yes. The door will not open without the handle. I must find it. Proving your worth, beast.
freaking speeders. I wonder what a half immersion would have looked like. A door lies on the other side of this pit, but these spikes need to be dealt with first. Spikes? Oh, those spikes. down there but then I'd be stuck. Bro, I'm getting like so immersed right now. I need to move the spikes to reach the door. Go through the freaking thing, bruh. Yep, just like that. A burial room. And there, a great warrior's crypt. These markings. This is the crypt of Ode the Brave. A legendary chieftain, a master bladesman. I need I should open the crypt and see what lies within. You want this thing, bro? Like this can turn the tide of battle. Use it well. So does a hero's weapon. Acquiring a hero's weapon forges magical bond to a hero. It can never be misplaced or lost. Trade with Loki to better understand. What do you think? I've created this training space in Ganungagop where I can show you fighting techniques, and you can practice them. Your sword is a hero weapon, located in your pouch and equip it. Weapons are magically linked to you. 
They will reappear at your side even after their throne. Nice. Now your turn. Nothing is better for survival than preparedness. Weapon to plunge deep into Tear's black heart. Now to find a way out. Can I like bust open this shit? There must be a way out. Type of burial chamber is this? Come on, shark guy. Use your power. What you see. Well, here it is. Come and claim it. Come and claim this sword. Go back to the shadow creatures. You will linger here no more. This is the way out, so be it. Come on. Ah, <sighs> the sea and fresh air. The beast is still with me. Good.
hit five targets. I think that's it. Oh, excuse me. So I appreciate everyone that came in today. Uh, came to hang out. Woo! This was cool. This was absolutely, like, awesome. Like, this was beyond awesome. Like, like, this was so cool. I, I love it. So I don't know if we're going to be playing her the whole time or if we're going to switch between different mortals. But I tell you what, this was uh, this was definitely worth it. This was freaking worth it, bro. You get to calibrate every time.